So this is a thing that I got. It's a optical disc storage device, and not sure that it entirely works. Um, it didn't come with a, a transformer, so I had to make one, which is this here, because the polarity was wrong. So let's see if this works. And as we can see down here, there's a number. We can change it. And then we can search for it. Oh. And this thing is supposed to be used to store CDs. Like this. And then we'd go. No. Now, as far as we can see, the storing mechanism works as it's supposed to. And we can actually put things in. Now, let's see if we can get the number 39 that we put in earlier out. Now it's supposed to kick it out, but it's not doing that. So either the the uh, motor is broken, or there's something else wrong with the the release system, which I'll probably take a look into later. Well, it's an interesting, curious device. I think it's from like the early 2000s because I've seen several different versions of this, like. But usually they look like like boxes instead of a, a donut thing. Well, yeah, this is for today's show and tell. Until later.